हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आर यूट्यूब चैनल स्टडी ड्रीम्स वी स्टार्ट आर वीडियो विद द फोर्थ चैप्टर ऑफ क्लास सिक्स साइंस बुक एंड दैट इज सॉर्टिंग मटेरियल इन टू ग्रुप डेफिनेशन ऑफ सॉर्टिंग ऑफ मटेरियल सॉर्टिंग ऑफ मटेरियल मीन्स द ग्रुपिंग ऑफ मटीरियल अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर सिमिलैरिटीज और डिफरेंसिस एज वेल एज देयर यूजेज स्टूडेंट्स डू यू एवर थॉट दैट वाई विंडोज आर ऑलवेज मेड ऑफ क्लास और वाई आर टेबल इज मेड ऑफ प्लास्टिक और वुड और ग्लास एंड नॉट ऑफ क्लॉथ दिस इज बिकॉज ऑफ द प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ मटीरियल दैट आर यूज टू मेकिंग डिफरेंट डिफरेंट ऑब्जेक्ट्स लाइक इफ वी मेक विंडो विद वुडन मटीरियल दैन वी कॉन्ट सी आउटसाइड द विंडोज वाइल दे आर क्लोज एंड सेम एज इफ आर टेबल इज मेड ऑफ क्लॉथ then cloth material do not bear the weight of the things which are placed on the table that's why glass or wooden material is used to make tables so these all are depend upon the properties of materials and their uses let's discuss the properties in detail first property is appearance appearance means how material look like based on appearance material are of two types first is shiny and second is dull if we talk about material like wood or plastic these materials are very dull and non shiny in appearance whereas metals like gold silver and diamond or iron these all are very shining material you can look in this picture the wood piece appear very dull while this gold biscuit looks so shiny and that is why we use gold and silver in our jewelries or ornaments because it make a person very attractive and very fascinative okay there is a word which is used in our book and that is luster the meaning of the word is the shine present in the material is known as luster and the object which has shining is known as lustrous material so gold silver and iron are our lustrous material second property is texture texture means the feel of any material when we touch different material we find that some are smooth and some are rough material have different different textures for example we take a flower in one hand and touch the bark of tree with other then we can easily differentiate the feeling of both the materials flower is sounds very smooth and very soft while the bark of the peel is very rough so in this manner we can differentiate the texture of different materials third property is hardness hardness means how material is hard and how much material is soft some of material can easily compressed while others cannot for example if we try to compress a wooden piece then we will not be able to do so but if we try same thing with teddy bear then we can easily compress it because that this teddy bear is made up of cotton and sponge so different material have different type of properties fourth property is physical state physical state means the form of material we have seen that water exist in three different form water ice and water vapors the water we drink is in the liquid state of water when we boil the water it change the state of water and transfer in it into water vapors or steam steam is a gaseous state of water when we freeze water we get ice and ice is a solid state of water most substance exist in three states and that is solid liquid and gas these are known as the three physical states of matter let us discuss about the three states in detail first is solid in solid state particles are tightly packed and there is very little space between them that is why they are fixed at their position and has definite shape and definite size wood 
एप्पल ग्लास एंड आइस आर सम ऑफ द एग्जाम्पल ऑफ सॉलिड स्टेट सेकेंड स्टेट इज लिक्विड स्टेट इन लिक्विड स्टेट पार्टिकल्स आर लेस टाइटली पैक्ड देन सॉलिड स्टेट दैट इज वाई दे फ्लो ईजीली एंड नोन एज लिक्विड मिल्क जूस ऑयल एंड वॉटर आर द एग्जाम्पल ऑफ लिक्विड स्टेट थर्ड स्टेट इज गैस इन गैस पार्टिकल्स आर वेरी लूजली पैक्ड दैट इज वाई दे कैन मूव वेरी क्विकली एंड चेंज देयर पोजिशंस गैसेज डू नॉट हैव फिक्स शेप एंड फिक्स साइज ऑक्सीजन एयर नाइट्रोजन एंड कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड आर सम गैस फिफ्थ प्रॉपर्टी इज ट्रांसपेरेंसी इट मीन्स द अबिलिटी ऑफ लाइट टू पास फ्रॉम द मटीरियल बेस्ड ऑन ट्रांसपेरेंसी थ्री टाइप ऑफ मटीरियल्स आर प्रेजेंट फर्स्ट इज ट्रांसपेरेंट मटीरियल दीज आर दोज मटीरियल दैट अलो लाइट टू पास आउट कंप्लीटली द एग्जाम्पल ऑफ ट्रांसपेरेंट मटीरियल्स आर ग्लास क्लीन वॉटर आइस एंड विंडोज थर्ड टाइप इज ओपेक द मटीरियल दैट डू नॉट अलो लाइट टू पास थ्रू दैम आर नोन एज ओपेक मटीरियल फॉर एग्जाम्पल अ ग्लास ऑफ मिल्क अ बोल अ डिजाइन ग्लास बनाना और डाइस ट्रांसलूसेंट इज अ थर्ड टाइप ऑफ दिस कैटेगरी दीज आर दोज मटीरियल दैट अलो ओनली अ पोर्शन ऑफ लाइट टू पास थ्रू दैम एग्जाम्पल ऑफ ट्रांसलूसेंट मटीरियल्स आर कंप्यूटर डिजाइंड मीर फ्रोजन ग्लास टिश्यू पेपर थिन प्लास्टिक एंड कलर्ड ग्लास टेक अ शीट ऑफ ग्लास एंड अ टॉर्च when we fall the light of this torch on this glass sheet then light is completely passed out from this sheet as like this so that we can say that glass is an example of transparent object while if we do the same experiment with the piece of wood then it do not allow the light to pass through them because of wood is an opaque object as shown in this video when we take a frosted glass there is a little portion of light passing from it that's why frosted glass is an example of translucent objects next property is solubility solubility means the ability of material to get dissolved in the water based on the solubility materials are grouped into two different categories first is soluble and second is insoluble those material which are completely dissolve in water are known as soluble materials for example salt is completely dissolve in water and sugar is completely dissolve in water so these are the example of soluble material and if we talk about sand in water this is an example of insoluble material because insoluble materials are those which are not dissolve in water completely apart from soluble and insoluble material there are two more terms which are miscible liquids and immiscible liquids miscible liquids are those liquids that mix with each other look at this picture in this picture water and orange juice are completely mixed with each other so this is an best example of miscible liquids immiscible liquids are those which do not mixed with each other as if we mix water and oil with each other there is a separate layer of oil on the water so these are the example of immiscible liquid so solubility is defined as the amount of given substance that can be dissolved in a certain amount of solvent seventh property is density density means how much a material is denser based on the density materials again divided into two categories first is floating and second is sinking a material with the density lower than that of water floats on it 
while a material with the higher density than water it get shrink in the water as you can see in this picture this is a wooden cork and it get floats in the water while if we take this piece of iron it get completely sink at the bottom of water eighth property is conductivity conductivity means the ability to conduct heat metals are basically metals are the good conductor of heat and electricity cooking vessels are always made of metals because they can easily conduct the heat similarly electrical wire are made of metal such as copper and aluminium as you can see in this picture the copper material present in the wire and these copper material help to conduct the electricity because these metals are very good conductor of electricity and if we talk about this bar and if we talk about the wooden bar this is a bad conductor of electricity because this material cannot conduct electricity ninth property is malleability malleability is a property which allow the metal to be hammered into thin sheets you can see in this process when this material is beaten with the hammer it get converted into it get converted into thin sheets as we all know gold is a most malleable metal that is why the ornaments and jewelries are made up of gold or silver last property is ductility ductility is a property which allow the metal to be drawn into wires gold and silver are the best example of ductile metals as we stretch the metal it can convert it into thin wires and these wire are used to make different type of objects so this is the end of our chapter i hope you may understand the chapter and we will meet in the next video till now bye bye